Hello everyone, Jasper Agler here from vbulletin.com and today I wanted to show you how to easily upgrade your vbulletin 3 forum using the new upgrader introduced in our new 4.1 series. And before starting any upgrade, the first and most imperative step that, you, that should be taken accounted for is backing up your database. And you can find more info, information about backing up your website in our documentation page or you can uh, watch previous videos that I've created about backing up your forum. So just search for it in our channel at www.youtube.com slash vbolton4. And also, before moving on, please disable all plugins that are currently running because these may interfere with the upgrade process. <clears throat> and so the version of vbolton that I'm currently running right now is 3.8.6 and I will upgrade to the latest stable version 4.1.0 so first download the files via the customer area at vbolton.com and then after you've download, downloaded the files and ex extracted the content of the zip files close your board via the admin control panel and go to the vbolton options and then turn your vbolton on and off and then under the form act active section choose the no option and save and after turning off your forum you can uh, begin uploading the files in the upload folder via FTP with the exception of the install.php file located in the install folder so delete this file and then after doing that everything is ready to go you don't need to change anything else so just upload all the content in the upload folder via file transfer protocol client and um, make sure that you overwrite and upload all files successfully and um, yeah this process may take a while depending on your connection and by the looks of it on my screen it will take around five to ten minutes so I would just fast for, uh, fast forward it to the next step of the upgrade process Okay, so everything has successfully been uploaded. We now only have to open the browser and point the URL to the install slash upgrade.php. So depending on the directory your vbulletin is installed in, all you have to do is input install slash upgrade.php into the browser. So since my vbulletin is installed in my form directory, I just have to type in my domain name and then type in slash forum slash install slash upgrade dot php and that's it and you will now be taken to the new upgrade script where you can just click on begin upgrade and so once it begins processing all you have to do is wait for the progress bar to reach 100% and um, this this new upgrade script is all automatic so just sit back and relax Hang on. Wait for it. Wait for it. <laughs> yeah, we're just waiting. And you can also click on the show details to see what is currently being upgraded. And, you know, if you have a different version of the 3 series, you can um, repeat exactly the same process for the 3.6.x and 3.8.x series. And of course, depending on the size of your form database, it may take a while to complete, so just be patient. And um, yeah, note that if any error occurs, just copy the error and please contact support. Do not continue with the upgrade. Doing so may cause irreversible damage to the database. And so I won't fast forward this video since I don't have a lot of data in my forum, so we'll just wait. And it's almost done. So we're at 98%. Wow, 98%, come on. Do, 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 do. <laughs> uh, 
I guess it's my server that's slow. Okay, we're done. Now just go to your admin CP. Just click on go to admin CP. Sorry guys, my mouse is not working very well. And just log into your admin control panel. And go to your settings, options. And see there are a lot of new options for you. But make sure you reopen your form. So go to turn your VBolton on or off. Click yes. Save. Now go to your form home. It worked. <laughs> Good job. So anyways, if you've enjoyed this video tutorial, please subscribe and check back for more. We will constantly add new videos to our channel. Enjoy.